Hello, this is Buona from Buona.tv, and today I want to talk to you about a new Twitter client that I found called Twirl, which is based on the Adobe Air platform that we all know so well. Prior to this video, I did a video on Snitter, which is another Twitter client based on the Adobe Air platform. But uh, I, I recently moved over to Twirl for several reasons, and I'm going to talk about some of these reasons now. The first thing you may notice in the Twirl client is... You know, it looks kind of the same as Snitter. It, it doesn't have a lot of visual differences. It supports styles, so you can create your own themes, per se. Um, but the thing that I like the most is what they call a unified timeline or a singular, single timeline. This timeline will show all of your friends' updates, your updates, as well as your replies and replies to you in one stream. So here we see someone who, who replied to me and it shows up in a green highlight all in the same stream. Now prior to this in Snitter I would have to go down to the menu and go to replies to see all of my replies but now I don't need to do that anymore. I can just go straight to my normal timeline and see all these different things. Another thing, another feature that I like about Twirl is the ability to denote who you're replying to by icon. If you look here, I have two replies here that I've done. And if you look at the icon, I'm not going to hover over it because you can't see it. But uh, in this particular post, I, uh, I replied to Daniel Brusilovsky. And you can see his icon below mine in the same post. So you get a visual visual representation of who you've replied to right within the timeline itself. So that's a nice feature as well. Now if I go into some of these other options, you may have uh, seen some of these in Snitter, but I'll talk about them anyway. There's the archive of my particular post. That's the sound for a new, a new twirl, a new, a new Twitter post. There's my uh, favorites. Also, uh, one of the things that's new with the twirl 0.50 is the ability to search, and it's powered by Terramines. Usually, you'd have to go to terramines.com slash Twitter to search Twitter. But if I want to search the entire Twitterverse for my name, it would search and here are all the posts that have my name in it so as you can see I got all kinds of stuff that, that doesn't show up in my timeline but I can search right within this client on everything that's on Twitter say I want to search everything about twirl it pops right up and it's pretty fast too it shows you everything that you want to see regarding that particular search item and another feature that I like which I've just done a video on is the ability to support hashtags so here we see hashtags mentioned in some posts that I did I have a pound or a hashtag twirl here and if I click that it launches the browser and it goes to hashtags.org slash tag and twirl and here you see all the posts which were posted on Twitter using that particular hashtag pretty nifty it's a nice feature built right into the client itself. So anytime somebody uses a hashtag within Twitter on either timeline, as you can see here, here's some right here for Snitter. If I click on Snitter, it'll take me to the same thing and here are all the people who've used hashtags on Snitter. So this is a nice feature that I, I particularly love about it. Uh, Snitter has it as well, but it's a little buggy. And Twitbin also has it for Windows if you want to use the hashtag, hashtag feature. All right. So there's also a, a lookup. You can look up various people. Like say I want to look up uh, Snitter. There's Snitter's profile and all of his updates. And I can also see my followers right from here. All of this is done via the API. I don't have to go to the website. I don't have to go uh, anywhere else. I can just stay right in Twirl and view all of this information. And finally, if you look at the timeline, when you hover over somebody's name, you get various icons. And one that I particularly like is called Retweet. So if I see someone's Twitter post that I particularly like and I want to show it to all of my followers, I just click on this Retweet button 
and it automatically copies and pastes the entire Twitter post and it precedes it with the word retweet and it tells you what it is and so on and so forth. So you can easily retweet Twitter posts within Twirl. All right, this is Borna from Borna.tv. Go visit Twirl at www.twhirl.org to download the client. It does require Adobe Air, the latest beta, which I believe is beta 3, and uh, you can do a lot within Twitter without ever having to go to the website. Enjoy. <laughs>